Next, we have word recognition. As for your options, um, if we go to options here and we go to advanced, word recognition start level is going to be PTA plus 40. Now this is how it's going to be set if you don't do your MCL under word recognition. Most providers, if they're not doing MCL, feel like this is a little bit too hot, so then they normally drop it down to PTA plus 20 or 30. If you're wanting to use MCL for your word recognition, you're going to start with that first. So on the right hand side, you have AUD, UCL, and MCL. If you select MCL, you can use the microphone as your stimulus, or you can use file and use one of the built-in word lists down here at the bottom for cold running speech. You can put in the rainbow passage down here and just basically say, okay, Mr. Smith, we are going to play some words and I want to increase and decrease the volume. Let me know when we're at your most comfortable listening level. So you can do a cold running speech by pressing play or start signal. Or what most providers do is they'll go to microphone and they'll hit start signal. And they'll say, okay, Mr. Smith, let me know when my voice is most comfortable for you. And if you can see at the bottom of the screen, there is a red M that has popped up now when I'm changing the DB level. So you can have them raise their hand or just say, okay, that's most comfortable for me in the right ear. If we go to the left ear, same thing. We're on microphone, word rack, MCL, start signal. Mr. Smith, let me know when my voice is most comfortable. Now you see a blue M. This is going to give you a DB level. So you can also do this with the UCL as well. Get a UCL uncomfortable level. Start signal. There's your U at the bottom. You can go right ear and get your UCL that way. Once you have your MCL, you can go back to AUD and now your test signal is going to start at your MCL. So for the right ear, we're at 65, which is where your marker is down here at the bottom. If you go to left ear, it's going to go up to 70, which is where your marker is at the bottom. As for word lists, um, you can use the built-in files, you can use the microphone as well. It is a little bit harder to do with the microphone, or if you have your own CD that you want to use, you can use that as well. The built-in word list, we click on that, go to auditory test, and then we have W22 list 1 all the way down to PBK-50. So you can select which list you want to use the list one form a is common and for this it's going to automatically advance after you hit correct or incorrect so you'll hit play it's going to say say the word and now you'll hit correct or incorrect and it's going to say say the word yard and all you have to do is just hit correct or incorrect all the way down the list and back in the options we have it set for 25 words so once we get to the 25th word a prompt is going to come up into the in the center of the screen and it's going to say auto limit reached um, it's just basically letting you know that you're at your 25th word um, to switch yours again for uh, your view and load you can always select view it's going to pull up the words you got correct and incorrect and of course you can always print this out and put it into a file or if you need to load a different list you can go to load put in NU6 list 3 form A. Um, below that we have masking which again is the same as your air, your air conduction at the beginning of the test. Um, masking is turned on.